What's going on YouTube? We're back today with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team video and today we are in week 5, two wins away from level demotion. This is going to be a good game. My opponent had the ball two times, I had the ball three times out of the whole game. It's a very quick game. It is a full game though, it's a good, great game. Comes down to the last play as we get a nice run there with Marshawn Lynch and then we get the warp tackles. If that wasn't in the game, we would have gone for a lot more. Give it to Lynch one more time and he's finding holes, making his way out to the 47. First and 10 where you roll out with Cam and decide not to throw it there. A little too risky early in the game, don't want to force, make a turnover and make a bad mistake. So we run it with Marshawn again. Third and four here, we scramble out, and this time we hit Calvin Johnson. And he gets all the way down to the 15. Good uh, yak there. First and 10, he run commits, and we break a tackle there and get it like five yards after what looked like should have been nothing. We give it to Marshawn Lynch here, juke to the inside, get the first down. And on first and goal, we give it to Marshawn Lynch again. Blocking was bad for some reason there. If Gronk and D.Y. would have uh, sealed that edge, that's a touchdown, but it wasn't. Second and goal, we dump it off to DeMarco, and he gets in the end zone, and we take a 7-0 lead with a lot of time left. First and 10 for him. We stuffed, his run, well, we stuffed the outside runs pretty well this game, but he loved to run screens on second and 11. He runs one here, but we bring uh, take him down just short of the first down. Third and one. He runs it up the middle and just gets it. I think he was got three on that. Second and nine here. He does another screen. He loved doing the screens. He had so many different out of every formation, so I was just trying to prepare for that thing. It hit me with something else. Here he goes to his fullback on the angle route and gets all the way to the 48. Second and nine here. He does a counter. But we are pretty much there to stuff that. I don't think he got a yard on that. So that brings up third and nine. Here he's looking and goes over the left side there. I don't know what Waggy was doing. Wasn't that Waggy? Yeah. Was doing there. He should have been covering that. Here he runs a screen and we just can't get the tackle on him. And second and three here he runs up the middle. And doesn't quite get it. He doesn't fall forward. So third and inches goes back to it. And for some reason, J.J. Watt was just standing there. I think we would have... Uh, I don't think he got the first down without the penalty, but he got the penalty yard, so he got the first down. First and ten here, he runs up the middle. I think that's Denard Robinson that he's using. Picks up five, does a fullback dive. Gets two yards there. Three yards. Third and one, goes up the middle. Can't get anything. So that brings up fourth down, and he decides to no huddle and go for it here on fourth and two. We're setting up the defense, and he does play action. He runs it to the right and just finds someone there and gets in the end zone to tie this game up right before halftime. And he gets ball after half, so that's a big boost for him. So we're on defense back-to-back -back drives. And this is, this is the third possession of the game. We've only had two possessions in the first half. It's kind of a short game. So first and ten here. Runs up the middle. Doesn't get a whole lot. My attack wasn't big this game. It was those screens that killed me. Right here goes the angle route. I was I knew it was coming, but I was stuck on the lineman, so I couldn't do anything about it. First and ten runs up the middle. This time it gets a decent amount. Gets the first down. He gets like 14 here, but he does a screen fly. I wasn't expecting it out of that formation. And he gets seven yards there. Six yards. Third and four here. Runs a draw play. He's falling forward for a decent amount. I think he actually got the first down. With Sproles there. Yeah, he did. Second and nine. Runs it up the middle again. This time we stop him. And that brings up third and ten here. Big stop if we can get it. But D'Angelo Hall takes a bad angle at that. And he gets the first down, unfortunately. So that brings up second and goal here. He runs up the middle and uh, can't quite get in there. Third and goal doesn't quite get in there, but of course, fourth goal, he eventually will get in there. So that means we got to cue the epic NFL primetime music to start our drive. Here we go. First and ten. We give it to Marshawn Lynch. Two-minute drill. He was running 
three deep there. I don't know why, so we'll take advantage of that. First and ten. We got Cam. We roll out with him. He can't get off the block. We found Cat. We find Calvin Johnson there for the first down, all the way down to the 49. First and ten again. We're rolling out with Cam. We decide to run with him, and we get the first down and get out of bounds to stop the clock. Next play, we run with Marshawn. He's rumbling, bumbling, and stumbling forward all the way to the 34. Once again, we run with Marshawn. He's breaking tackles because he eats spinach before his games. And Skittles helps too. First and 10, we roll out. He doesn't cover Jordy Nelson. We throw it to him. He just gets in there for the touchdown, and we tie this game up. But there is still 55 seconds left in this game. So... We need a big stop here. He throws one up, and we can't quite get the interception. He ends up actually almost catching the ball there. Second and ten, he does a crossing pass. I went with the wrong one. He threw it to the other one. So he had to call a timeout there. First and ten, he's looking, and uh, Sherman can't come up with the interception. That would have been huge there. But that brings up third and ten. He has to throw it deep somewhere. He throws it to the left side and Steve Atwater is there for the interception and he returns it all the way down to the 34. It's a huge return there. First and 10. We got to get in better field goal range because this game is a little laggy. So we hit Calvin as you see we get a major lag there. What is going on? And first and 10 we kick the game winning field goal. And we end up winning this game 17 to 14. I don't know why that just did it, did that, but okay. And we end up winning this game, very close game, very good game. But at least this time we came out victorious on the last play of the game instead of the second week two, I think it was, or maybe it was week three that we came out with the L. But that's it for this video. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Follow me on Twitter. I'm out. Till next time, do work.